At last, the promise has been made. Reunion at hand may bring joy, it may bring fear, but let us embrace whatever it brings. For they are coming back. At last, the promise has been made. Okay, it's late at night. I am armed with a black cherry soda, which is very good. You know, I had friends over, and I said, yeah, look at my mini fridge if you want something to drink. And they're like, Dante, all of this stuff is cursed. I'm like, yeah, because every time I get something reasonable to drink, it goes faster than all of the like seasonal Mountain Dews I collect. I got Mountain Dews from like a, like, like a year and a half ago, maybe two years ago. And they're bad. And they've also gone through like a metamorphosis because they've they at something happened they froze in there. What happens with soda when it freezes is that it like the part of it like the carbonated like carbonation and like the water essentially like freezes into an, a block of ice and all of the flavoring and syrup and stuff sort of separates from it. <laughs> and so now they so they, they also just taste like flat essentially. It's not good. It's not good. I should I should drink one. I should drink one during during this. It would last me long enough because I can only sip it. it. The the Mountain Dew Fruit Quake is like drinking the worst part of juice, and it it's like it's like it's got the it's got the like let's say texture of drinking a soda with none of the joy of drinking a sugary beverage, and then it has like the flavor of juice without the like nice refreshing qualities of juice. Um, so basically it's just a bad drink all around. It's a, just like a truly awful thing. Sponsor me Mountain Dew. I'll drink whatever you make. I'll drink, I'll drink anything. Um, I've got, I've got me, me standards, zero. All right, but we're back with this now. Making our way to Junon Harbor. Hey, if you've been enjoying anything on this channel or this somehow for some reason, then uh, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell to get notified of more things in the future. Uh, episodes of this just about every day. Uh, links in the description of other things that I am doing, have done, or will be doing in the future. Um, check out, I have all kinds of stuff on this channel. I upload, I mean, I just recently uploaded a like spoken word piece that I made and dedicated to a friend of mine um, after we took a trip somewhere. Uh, so if that's your kind of, if, if you're going to want to get real moody and sad a little bit, a little kind of like dreary sad boy hours, you can go check that out. I got other things like that too. I got some videos of speed drawings that I've made. I've got a bunch of videos of me playing games. I have some videos about me talking about games. I have some animations on here. I just put here, this is just a channel for any, I, I go into this. I want to set no expectations for what to expect when coming to the channel because I don't want to get locked into a thing. I just want to make stuff that I feel like making, do things that I feel like doing, and I'm just kind of committed to that. Uh, is it conducive to like uh, turning this into a thing? No, but that's kind of okay because if it doesn't turn into that, it might probably probably would probably would be better. 
ultimately. That means I could keep just making whatever I want to make. Uh, easier, anyways. Um, yeah. With that, let's just keep going. I'm gonna head right into June and Harbor. June and Harbor is interesting because it's kind of another case of like there's a town built underneath a big Shinra structure, which is interesting. Left These things are so odd. These things like really give me like cryptid vibes. Dang. Dang, Yuffie did. Well, I mean, we did we did get Yuffie. Oh yeah, last time we saw a massive cutscene at Calm. That was very revealing. Revealed a lot about Sephiroth, who he is and why he is this way. Um, ran into some aftermath of the Sephiroth freaking turning the Midgar Zolom, a giant snake, into a shish kebab. We did a bunch of extra stuff, got a bunch of enemy skills, which are gonna just help us one-shot, one-shot, like, every enemy for, like, for the foreseeable future. Uh, we found Yuffie, so we have a brand new party member, got her a new weapon immediately. And now we're heading here to try and, uh, pursue Sephiroth. What happened to this town? It's so run down. Yuffie in red had nothing to say about that? Well, this is rare. We almost never have anyone other than Shinra people visit this town. Um, is there anything to do immediately here? Uh, looks like no. We just want to make sure that everybody in our party has the ability to use some long-ranged attacks, which they presu they, they seem to. This is a nice little home. Little, little cobblestone home. Nice and cozy. There's gonna be a lot of things to pick up in June on, though. Ever since Shinra built that city up above the war- Up above during the war. Ugh. Been no fish in the water. Got so polluted. Yeah, it's, it's literally like another Midgar, essentially, just on a smaller scale. Shinra really, really likes to build uh, their stuff on top of everything. Oh, sorry. You even got anything for me, old man? He said you got a. If you see a weapon you like, you got nothing. What kind of place is this? Who are you people? Where did you come from? You see a man with a black cape? Hmm, I've never seen that fellow before. Alright. <laughs> just, just ask him. Shinra Inks Elevator, don't be snooping around here. This is, this is June and Harbor, right? I am in the right place? Oh yeah, I think I am. Hey, Mr. Dolphin. Hi, Priscilla. <laughs> How you say it. What, the dolphin? Who are you guys? Are you members of Shinra, Inc.? We don't get along with the Shinra. That's how it is. I don't believe you. Get out of here. Great. Whoa, God. <laughs> Whoa, God. Oh, oh, actually, that's an appropriate response. Jeez. Be careful, Mr. Dolphin. No, Priscilla. Priscilla, it's a sea monster. It's literally a sea monster, Priscilla. <laughs> Thank you. 
Boss time, baby, let's go. It's weak to wind, which is good because... Um, does it have anything to steal? No. Cloud, I didn't check ahead of time, but Cloud should still have the Choco Mog thing on his sword, which means he should be doing a million damage with just like normal attacks, I'm pretty sure. Fire, not bad. It nullifies Earth. Halves gravity, halves, and then it's weak to wind. How much does a cloud attack from cloud do? The heck did it just do to Yuffie? Yuffie's in a bubble. 248? I mean, yeah, that's pretty good. I think. Oh, Yuffie can't do anything. Yuffie's also... Oh, do we need to pop Yuffie? Okay, well you do that. Red, can you attack Yuffie? A big wave. Yikes, chill out. Wait, that was zero damage? Ow, that didn't help either. <laughs> Yuffie, <laughs> Yuffie, don't die. Wait, is Cloud in a bubble too now? Wait, now what? Huh? What's the like, uh, what are we doing? <laughs> How do we, how do we not be in a bubble anymore? I need to cure, I need to cure Yuffie again. Oh, we got multiple uses of cure all, that's good. Uh, the all material must have upgraded, I think. Is, are we really not like allowed to do anything for forever now? Or like what's, what what's the deal? Oh, do we need to use magic on a bubble? I guess I can try it. We really need to get Yuffie out of there. Um, oh, that did it, okay. Yuffie. Yuffie, I'm gonna have to have you pop cloud. This is an interesting fight. It's been a little while, so I'm not 100% uh, <coughs> Cleon, on it. Cleon on it again. No! <laughs> no, please! <laughs> Gosh dang it. Oh my gosh, wait, people had things from... Oh dang, that... Cloud was hanging on to that high potion from, from way back. I'm like, I'm like still trying to recover from having to pop everybody's bubbles, jeez. Hey, yeah, wow, okay, so they really hang on to the... That's so silly. Ow. Kill yourself. Oh yeah, definitely kill yourself. Jeez. Oh. Maybe if you got a limb break. Oh, does it use big wave once it? <laughs> Wait. Wait. So you could kill it and then it would just die? That seems kind of freaking rude. I'm not gonna lie. Power of I'll take it. This is bad. Don't you think she's dead? Oh wait, you don't think she's dead, do you?
Nope, she's not breathing. Okay, help her. Young man, do CPR. Not the mouth. You know I can't. <laughs> what? But she's just a girl. Do okay, this is... Uh, uh, this is sort of... I know, don't get me wrong. Good to be dis <laughs> good to be uncomfortable about it. You should... I, I If Cloud was excited about it, I'd be a little worried. Um, does she... However, old man, are you not like her relative or something? Do we got like a relative that could show up? Do it, do it, Cloud. I mean, yeah, it's kind of... What? You don't know how? Come over here, I'll show you. What? Why don't you just do it at this point, man? Guess I gotta do it. Take a deep breath, hold it in, and breathe into her. Hurry up and do it. You, how much, how, you didn't really show me anything, okay. Press Y once to start CPO gauge. Press it again to stop the gauge. Oh, oh, whoops, okay. You trying to aim for like as much as possible? Live! <laughs> Live! <laughs> I mean, I think, I don't think you can fail this, right? Although the longer it's taking, the more concerning it's kind of getting. I, I'll, I will admit that. <laughs> oh, whoops. That ain't gonna do it. Oh, nice. <laughs> it did it. Well, sweet, that wasn't that bad. Oh, we could have poisoned the guy, too. Or put him to sleep, I guess. Don't think that would have worked. Good to know, though. Okay, let's see. Red 13 would make an excellent candidate, but Cloud is instead asked to perform CPR. <laughs> Okay, Absolute Steve, you need to chill out. How about that, bud? Sorry, Cloud. Priscilla needs to rest for a while. Okay. Do we need to stay at the inn? Is there an inn? Alrighty. We'll just go to the one place I know that has three beds. Ma'am? Ma'am? <laughs> Hello? Ma'am? Oh, hey, come in for a while. Thanks? That's literally all I wanted. <laughs> I heard what happened. You've done so much for Priscilla. Well, I mean, all I did was make sure she didn't die. Which is a decent amount of stuff. But I'll be tired. If you want to get some rest, stay here. Well, thanks. Make yourself at home. Shall we rest? Sure. Oh, I don't like this. You know, that reminds me. You again. Who are you? We'll find out soon. But more, more importantly, five years ago. Five years ago, Nibelheim? When you went to Mount, Nib Mount Nibel. Tifa was your guide, right? Yeah, it surprised me. Where was Tifa other than that? I, I don't know. 
It was a great chance for you two to see each other again. You're right. Why couldn't you see each other alone? I don't know. I can't remember clearly. Why don't you try asking Tifa? Yeah. Then get up. Oh, hi, Tifa. Tifa? When Sephiroth and I went to Nibelheim, where were you? We saw each other, right? The other time. N no, it was five years ago. I, I don't remember. But s something seems strange outside. Cloud, come quick. Hmm. Yeah, things maybe aren't entirely lining up. What what are the what are those sequences gonna look like in the new one? The ones where you have like a another voice speaking to you, and Cloud is like trying to like unravel things in his mind. Hmm. Questions. Past few decades, the only thing I've been hearing about is the Shinra. I miss the times when we used to talk about the only fish. Aerith, how'd that girl regain consciousness? Seems like something's going on up there. Doesn't it seem a little strange, everything getting so noisy all of a sudden? Oh, I know what this is. Does this have something to do with the Shinra? What's this loud music? It's giving me a headache. Hi, Priscilla. You're not dead. Dang, Priscilla, you got some big feet. What the crud? You're all right now. Um, thanks for helping. I'm sorry, I mistook you for one of the Shinra ink. That's alright. I'll give you something special. It's an amulet, take good care of it, okay? Shiva, heck yeah, baby, let's go. What's that music? It sounds so lively. I heard they're rehearsing the reception for the new Shinra president. Rufus. I gotta pay my respects. Grandpa and Grandma told me the speech was beautiful when they were small. But after the Shinra built the city above, the sun stopped shining here and the water got polluted. I was raised on that st oh, I was raised on that story and I hate Shinra so much I could die. Oh, jeez. I think Rufus is about- is thinking about crossing the ocean from here, too? What, does that mean Sephiroth already crossed the ocean? Cloud, didn't you finish Rufus off? Gotta get to the town up there. Maybe we could climb the tower? No, no, there's a high voltage current running underwater. Or running underneath the tower. Don't wander near it, it's dangerous. But you might be able to if Mr. Dolphin helps you. Follow me. <laughs> They'll look back like, no, I'm being serious, by the way. <laughs> high voltage tower? Guess this means Cloud will have to do it. <laughs> what the heck? Yeah, better leave it to Cloud. I'm counting on you, Cloud. Hey, wait a second. <laughs> That's so funny. Red 13 and Yuffie are talking? Aren't you gonna follow her? Looks like a Shinra soldier. Don't you just hate this? You're probably right. Yeah, I'd like to take a good look at the new president of Shinra Inc. Mm. Okay, well before we do that though Let's see OT for outside the second Fort Condor battle has an extremely short time span If you wish to do it, you must do it right now Don't go to Basil, but head straight to Fort Condor just as Cloud- well, wait with just Cloud as a party member? Dang The prize for this condor battle is a peace ring, unless, of course, you missed the first battle, in which case you received the previous prize. Right, right, so we have to do this. Okay. Wait, so we have to go? We can just leave just as Cloud? That's crazy to me. Okay, so Cloud's just gonna be a higher level than other characters for sure. Alright. 
Um, Fort Condor is not too far away. It's just right there. What a weird time, like there's already a second battle and you already have to go and do it again. But that's fine because we have this. We got Macho Magic and we got Beta too. Could just spam Beta, but Macho Magic is a little faster. And it, and it does just enough damage, to be fair. Yeah, that, that conversation with Tifa is very interesting. It's like, yeah, wait, no, where were you the second time? Like, the, the other time that we went up to the thing, and Tifa's like, I don't know what you mean. Like, why weren't, like, why weren't we together for that? <laughs> Tifa's like, I don't know. It's, you know, it was five years ago. How would I remember? However, in the re in the Rebirth trailer, they have Tifa, Tifa say a line that's a little bit more suspect. That, that makes her a little bit more suspect. Um, I'll just do this, whatever. Get my normal attacks back. Um, well, you hear Sephiroth say... You basically, like, you saw her die, so then who is she? Referring to uh, presumably Tifa. Um, which means that, like, on top of the stuff that's already going to be happening to Cloud, he's gonna then, I guess, start to... Like... He's gonna start getting prodded... Uh... By Sephiroth? Like, Sephiroth's going to start, like, planting... Those que like qu those thoughts and doubts into his mind, even even harder. <clears throat> Tifa's so Tifa makes me so sad though. Tifa just truly like breaks my heart as a character. She tries so hard and she doubts herself so much and she just wants people to be okay. We'll get some rest, Cloud says to an empty room. <laughs> Cloud is not okay. So the guide said that this this Fort Condor battle is actually like pretty time sensitive. Like this is the only time you could possibly come and do this. Which is crazy to me because like we just did one. <clears throat> Hold on. Well, yeah, wait. This is crazy. <clears throat> Yeah, listen to this, okay? So we do this, we do this one, right? And then it has a, and it has a, a small paragraph talking about Junin. Priscilla will come outside and hand Cloud the pendant, the Shiva material, yeah. Uh, head to the beach, talk to Priscilla, who will give you a whistle to call Mr. Dolphin wherever you like. Um... Yeah, right after you get the whistle, just head back to Fort Condor once again to do the third battle. The time span for this battle is once again rather small. That's crazy. Like, so small that we have to do them back to back like this? Okay, well... Did I even do this right? Because it actually says that you follow Tifa outside and then you immediately go to the second one. But no, it says right after you get the whistle, you head back to Fort Condor. So we should be fine. I think. I hope. <laughs> Please. Have mercy. Hey there, bud. Perfect timing. They're just around the corner. Get ready. Okay. I'm ready. The barbarians are mixed during this attack. There are more than 20. Set it for a ba balanced attack or we'll be in trouble. Alrighty. Um... Sure thing. I mean, let's just dish out some freaking dough, right? 
these units are freaking expensive. And this is my this is my actual money. Um Yeah, I'm gonna try to set this up right. Rocks. Rocks everywhere, as far as the eye can see. <clears throat> um, okay, hold on. Actually, can I... No. <clears throat> Let's go attacker, 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 and a, uh... Sure. And then what other things do I have? I have uh, a repairer for healing people. Should I buy one of these? I could. There's gonna be tw more than, did he say 20 enemies or more than 20 enemies? Jeepers. Can roll a stone. Can't move. Can't move. Stoner. Can roll a stone. <laughs> Freaking weird, okay. I'm not 100% sure what that means. And set a bomb. Alright, starting the game. Let's do it. As long as I can't be hit by my own catapults and stuff. Attack that person, action, attack. Action, you can attack that person. I'm gonna have things speed up. Enemy destroyed? Awesome. Oh, actually. Mm. This guy, oh, this guy freaking shot me at the moment. Whoa. There's a lot of freaking dudes here. <clears throat> um, okay. Jeez. Beats Barbarian. Okay, well, what we need here, right? We need one of these guys. There's so many enemies. I'm actually kind of flabbergasted. Uh, okay. Oh, this shooter's actually okay. The shooter has, like, not been attacked before. Keep attacking and stuff. Um, I feel like, can I have a bomb guy, and then can I have this bomb guy set a bomb? Don't hit my worker, please. Set a bomb. <laughs> please, this poor worker. I put him in a bad spot. To be fair, I put him in a pretty bad spot. I'm fighting like way lower than I- I should have like waited to move my units lower and then put catapults down where I am. I can still build a catapult, I suppose, if I wanted to. Ooh, I'm gonna probably have to sell a bunch of, uh, ethos after this. I'm short on cash. This is expensive. And then I'm gonna have another one of these right after? Like, literally right after? That's crazy to me. Oh, dang. I really need you to get the heck out of there, man. Oh, dang. That actually died. What a bummer. Attack that guy. Thank you. Oh, that's a barbarian? Who's good against barbarians? Loses to barbarian. Loses to... Beats barbarian. Okay. He got to shoot me the moment I spawned. That's messed up. <laughs> cool. Oh, dang. 52 damage to these guys? Jeez. Can be destroyed? Cool. Yeah. I'm just throwing... I'm just saying, screw it. I gotta do it, so I gotta do it. Oh, the freaking big guy. Um, action. No. What we need to do... What we need to do is kill this guy. <laughs> Quickly. <laughs> um, and I would love to do so without having to kill the other guys. But I don't think that's going to happen. Because it, it seems like it's really hard for people to move past each other. Wait, what? Ah, oh, criminy. Yeah, it's not great, but it's what I have. So... That's also not great, but it's also just what I have. Yeah, you really gotta play weaknesses, it seems like. The 
bombs just seem like they don't maybe do much, you know what I mean? Seriously? Oh man, okay. Oh, that was like not great. That was like not an amazing, amazing move right there. Oh, and he's like, he's like, he like gets, he's weak against this guy too. I'm just like not paying attention. In my defense, this is not the main game right here. <laughs> this is a different game. Yeah, I just sent that guy to die. Wait, that one dude I sent up there couldn't... Hold on. He couldn't kill this one enemy? He even swung on him first. Like, seriously? Am I just gonna- am I gonna be, like, dirt poor after this? Why is all- 400 on every single unit? Really? Oh, jeez, man, I don't know. Um, I'm gonna have these guys move up. Up and behind. The bomb really quick, and I'm gonna see if I can lead this guy to it. Because <clears throat> I feel like I'm gonna need this bomb damage. <laughs> oh my gosh, I think I might have lost. Holy crud. My god, they're attacking. We're counting on you. What the heck is this thing? Whoa. Um. I mean, this thing is not that bad. I might have to reset and try that again, to be completely honest. That was brutal. Like, truly just brutal. What, are, what is this guy, though? And I'm poisoned, too? Gosh. Everything is going poorly. How much, like, HP does this guy have? Part of me is almost like, just die and, and freaking reset, but I don't know. I'm gonna have to see, like, what condition I'm in, because if, if I, if I win this but I'm absolutely out of funds, then I'm just gonna have to, uh, like, redo this for sure. Jeez. Like, I also is a tank. <laughs> Vagarist Claw? Made it through that one somehow, but shouldn't it be back? Be sure to look again. Oh, I don't even get a thing for that? Oh, I don't even get a thing for that. Oh. That's like a- that's like essentially a fail state. Okay. End current game. <laughs> I'll try that again. And I'll let you know when it turns out good? Question mark? Yeah, that was rough. I don't remember it ever being that difficult. Crazy. Hold the phone. Okay, I I reread the tips on Fort Condor. I said it's pretty easy. It said it's pretty easy though if you do Apparently you win. I must have missed I must have missed this this detail. Apparently you win if all the enemies on the screen are destroyed without being able to summon any reinforcements. So what I've been doing is setting up a scenario where I have to just get killed. I just have to like kill every- like wade my way through every single enemy. Um, which is obviously how I lost all my money. <laughs> and all those troops. So, uh... Okay, ready. So apparently what we want to do is- but obviously we need to like claim territory so we can't- we can only start right- like right here. So we're gonna do that, start the game. So we just need to kill all these things. Like quickly. Boy, this bird sure did slip past. So the idea is you have a you you claim as much territory as you can as quickly as possible. And then you just with whatever troops you had sent. Yeah, you just have the troops spawn down here before and more enemies can even come back. I regret that I still don't want to be spending a bunch of money. Probably, did, probably shouldn't have spent all the money on just the normal basic fighters. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Are you guys still chasing down this bird? This one bird made it all the way past...
we're we're re we're restarting. <laughs> Gosh dang it. Okay, I very quickly did something. I reloaded to the save from right before we started, uh, right before we went to Junon in the first place, because the guy did specify that we that you want to come here before even talking to anybody, before even talking, going to Priscilla. And I thought it meant to Priscilla once you see her the first time and she goes down to go talk to Mr. Dolphin. I think, but it means like before even going to see her and check on her and make sure she's okay. So, I, uh, I redid the fight. I did redid that. We did a little cutscene. Walked all the way back here. Because I, because I figure... If I'm going through all the trouble, right, of doing this, I don't want to set myself up for failure because I went slightly later than I was supposed to. You know what I mean? Like just around the corner? Okay, buddy. Okay. I know what needs to be done this time. Okay. Least out the thing. Okay, now what we do here is... Action attack. Action attack. Action attack. Move these guys down. Attack. Attack, because the goal here is to make sure um what we want is to clear the screen before more enemies spawn we want to basically like flood the spawn points where with our enemies right so attack good you keep doing that attack yes Good, yes, this is good. Where the heck is this guy going? Why aren't you attacking? Get freaking get in there. Yeah, good. This guy hasn't even been hit yet. And that's another thing another mistake I was making is that I was having like singular units of uh, fighting a guy. When there could have been other like there could have been other units getting free hits in, because um, I was having people face tank enemies for like way too long. So I think this should be fine now. This guy just has just not been moving this whole time. Cause yeah, when you have when you have like a bunch of your units stacked on top of each other, wailing on one guy, they die in two seconds. Like that, just like die die in two seconds. Uh, apparently that that fang that I got from the commander is that something you can get the first the, for the first three times because that's that's that guy I guess is always the commander the first three times you do this but um yeah oh my gosh they're flooding so many guys in on this side though <laughs> like I literally don't know what I'm supposed to do. There's just too many freaking guys over here. They spawn. They spawn four enemies on top of each other on this side. Seriously? I like don't want to move these guys from there. I'm still spending a lot of freaking money on units and stuff, but they just look how many freaking dudes they spawn over here. Not to mention two barbarians, which sucks. Should I should have this? Should have this, I think. Yeah, one, two more hits. Oh, jeez. <clears throat> it was. Oh, I like the <laughs> the 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 uh, chip tune version. Well, that was good. But Shinra's troops will be back. Be sure and scout the area well. We don't know when they'll attack again. We have four allies left, so here's 800 gil. Yeah, I found this just now on the battlefield. Maybe it'll come in handy for you guys. Peace ring. There we go. Um, yeah, no, that's real. That was re that's this really spends my actual money. 
which is kind of mind-boggling to me, but okay. Yeah, like, truly, truly brutal. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, they just when they spawn six enemies down one lane, like, what am I supposed to do? Yeah, I'll boost myself up to there. Uh, oh, no, I don't need to. Okay, and then here's a goofy thing, right? Well, now we gotta run all the way back to Junon, progress the story by, like, one inch, and then we have to run all the way back here to do a third thing, which is just so funny. Um... Short span of time, yeah. But while we have a moment, let's actually look now. Because what we got, there's the power wrist. Increases strength by 10, pretty good. Um, protects against berserk, fury, and sadness. Oh, interesting, so no, no mood changes, essentially. Kinda want this one. Cool. Well, all right, so I'm gonna run all the way back. Uh, have Priscilla go walk down to the beach, and then I'm gonna run all the way back here. <laughs> oh dear, I, you know, I knew, I knew at some point this, doing this 100% was gonna start to get goofy. But this is, uh, kinda hilarious. <sighs> okay, well back here, again. <laughs> After moving the story forward to, to uh, like, like like 30 seconds, here we freaking go. Probably just gonna speed this up though, I think. It's gonna be the same thing again. What? Uh, I didn't hear that. Huh? Hmm? Wait, what? What do you mean? One moment. Crud, wait, no, it's right after we get the whistle, not- I thought it said right before we get the whistle. Why can't I read? Why am I so bad at reading? Aw, oh, man, I gotta run all the way back. I'm in shambles. Alright, okay. So we need to get the whistle from Priscilla. Wait a minute. Now ain't that something. I've never seen no dolphin jump like that. Pretty cool, huh? When I blow this whistle, Mr. Dolphin jumps for me. Here, this is for you, Cloud. A gift? What am I supposed to do with it? Blow the whistle to... Just go in the water, blow the whistle, and Mr. Dolphin will jump to the top of the pole. Jump to the top of the pole? See that rod sticking out at the top? If you jump just right, you can climb to the top of the town. Good luck, Cloud. If you make it, we'll follow you. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I'll hold the PHS for you. It'll break if it gets wet. You want to jump with Mr. Dolphin? I'll pass. Come back whenever you want to see Mr. Dolphin. Okay. All right. I think now we can, we can do it. I'm assuming if we said yes, let's do it, then... Then I would have had to... I'm assuming I would have had to do it immediately, right? <laughs> we still have all this stuff. <laughs> Cloud's still wearing his bikini briefs. What the crap? Uh, hmm. Oh, mm, I don't know. I don't know. I'm concerned. We can exit. All right, let's see here. I'm gonna save it to an empty slot. I'm gonna enter back in. I'm gonna see if I can get the whistle and then leave, or if or she's gonna force me like into the water to whistle. 
Is this a dolphin? Sure. Get out of the water? Yes. Yeah, yeah? It says, right after you get the whistle, just head back to Fort Condor once again. Yeah, I mean, I mean, surely this must be correct, right? I'm almost concerned. I almost want to, like, not even... I won't... You know what? I'm going to be extra sure, just to make sure. I'm going to quit, and then just load that save of me exiting the town, because that should be fine. And then I'll go back, and then we'll see. And then I'll see you then. On the other side of this nightmare. Well, okay, they want to tumble again. I mean, this is going to be the same thing again. So I'll probably just either speed this up or just jump to me being done with it. So I'll see you in a bit. I think I just got it. That's just it, right? That's just it. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. It's not that bad. I probably spent more money than I needed to. Well, but then again, you need a lot of units to be able to drag the, um, your, your territory down. It was good, but Shinra's troops will be back. Be sure to scout the area well. We don't know when they'll attack again. Eight allies. Can we see? Yeah, give me that money back. Oh, yeah, I found this just now in the battlefield. Maybe it'll come in handy for you guys. Tincture. So, what's a tincture? Uh, little clip, that's... Hmm. Hello? Tincture? Please? Is it a, is it a material? Is it... <laughs> Feel, uh, battle? Am I missing something? Confused? <laughs> oh, okay. I read the guy. I read the guy. It's ethers. It, he said it, it's. They call them tinctures, but it it's three ethers. Weird. Why did they? Why? Why did? Why? <laughs> why? Okay. We're well, going back to June on for Pete's sake. All right. We're back. We're doing it. I know what's up ahead. It's gonna be a little bit of town exploration coming up soon as well, but for now we need to do this. Want to jump in the water with this dolphin? Sure. Okay, so what I gotta, I gotta get up here? On that pole? Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, am I trying to get on to... Ow! Oh, I got tased. <laughs> oh, no. There's high voltage running through the bottom of the tower. Don't go near it. Gotcha. Uh, oh, no, I got that. See the rod sticking out at the top? Jump, jump to that. Gotcha. Let's do it. Okay, I understand. Oh, sure, I, I get it. Gotta be this rod that I'm looking at right here, right? Am I am I wrong? <laughs> this is pretty goofy. I mean, sure, surely this is what it. This is the rod she's talking about, right? I can't go to the bottom there. 
So... Yeah? A little closer? Am I trying to be under it? What are we trying to be right now, Mr. Dolphin? <laughs> what are we trying to do right now, Mr. Dolphin? Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 okay. Huh, weird. I don't know why that was so much trouble. Alright, uh, we got a mini game coming up. Oh, a little FMV? Oh, cool. Gosh, the FMVs are, are, are like, really cool, legitimately. Oh, oh, that's, oh, no, that, that's not a chest. They use the chest thing, and oh, there's a bunch of... Hello, Carrie is over there too. I think this is actually a switch. Yeah, that's cool. The actual like pre-rendered stuff starts to like get animated too. Oh, President, he's here. He's here. Hurry, hurry. Hey, you still dressed like that? Come here. <laughs> sure thing, boss. What's up? Here, get in here. And I love that Cloud just goes with it. Today's a big day with President Rufus. Hurry up and change. It's a Shinra uniform. I'm, ch I'm changing. Brings back memories. Quit yapping, hurry up. Brings back memories, huh, Cloud? I thought you, uh, well, you've always been a soldier, haven't you? So proud when I first put it on. Oh, I'm trying to put the pants on. Wonder what it was. I couldn't stand wearing this thing anymore. Wow, looking good in it. You remember the greeting procedure, right? <laughs> Shrugging, nope, nope, not even a little bit. The look on your face says you forgot. Alright, I'll show you again. Do just like I do. Now, I did read the notes. It says you want to get to the empty spot in line as quickly as you can, and then at the end of every single line of dialogue, you do a thing? Do just like I do. Commander, we'll help too. This is how you do it. We'll sing too. I right, show him. Now march. It's, this is the welcoming march. Then I'll sing along with you. Quietly. Hey, come on now. Keep in step with the soldier next to you. New era, President Rufus. <laughs> okay. Once you in step, shoulder your gun. Got it? Not yet. To oh, shoulder your gun. Press A. Once you in step, shoulder your gun. To shoulder your gun, press A. Practice some more. Okay, interesting. I think we're good, but let me just check again. So Absolute Steve, friend of the show, says, Many people have a hard time scoring over 50%. We want to try to aim for 50, because that gives us a lot of gill. Um, so I'm going to try for that, but you know, <laughs> whatever happens, happens. Uh, it's actually very simple. When, when you gain control of Cloud, it's best to just run immediately downwards, straight to the line of soldiers, and take the empty spot. Walk to the left while staying in line. Don't press circle until after the first message command appears. After this, simply press circle at the end of each message. Now, to make the rating shoot up. The now, okay. All right. If you say so, all clear. Good, make sure you do well at the real parade. If this is the right, preparation complete. Well, Godspeed, I say to myself. 
All right, showtime. Don't disgrace yourselves. I, this is such a funny sequence, though. Look at look at Cloud running with a gun. Ooh, look at dynamic freaking shots. This game is so cinematic. Welcome parade begin. Oh, and there's Rufus. Where am I, though? Oh, yeah, the unveiling, the unveiling of the cannon. Which is horrifying. And also, one massive cannon aiming in one direction out in the ocean seems, uh... Like an abhorrent waste of money. <laughs> oh no, no one's here. Late? Hey rookie, it's your fault we're running <laughs> running around like that. Captain, we'll take a shortcut. Right. Good idea. Get over here. <laughs> I can't wait to meet these characters in the new game. It's because the sequence is so funny. Cloud running like this, like a goober. I just love that you basically start to just be like, you just become quick pals with this group of people. Feels so like, uh, like, you, like, you're running late, like, you're at school, you're running late for an event. <laughs> yes, sir. I'll go first. Now, you watch closely as I do, rookie. Can you see an opening? Go for it, gotcha. Play the broadcast around the channel world. If you look bad, don't join on me. Remember, don't screw up. Okay, jump in when I give you a sign. Just sneak in from the back, don't mess up the row. No matter what you do, don't try to go in <laughs> from the front. Alright, start marching. Oh, he's gonna give me charge. What the hell is that soldier doing? I don't know. Are the points up? Well, it's so so. Hmm. Better send that soldier something. Wait, was that it? Wait, that's all there was? Wait, that was the whole thing? All that preparation just for that? <laughs> I had like two seconds to get 50% plus. <laughs> Good, we made it. Can I this? Yeah, line up and shut up. Don't make a move. How's the job? I can't believe- I can't believe that was it. All of that, like, preparation for just, like, two seconds. What did I get? Okay, I didn't do it as badly as you possibly could have. I got from 30 to 39%? Shoot. It said that... Press circle at the end of each message. Dang. Up into the airship. Long-range airship. Still being prepared. Should be ready in three more days. Long range airship, okay. Even the Air Force's Gil Gelnica? G Gelnica? Stop that stupid horse laugh. There are things different. Oh, things are different than when father was in charge. Yeah. Is the ship ready? Yes, sir. We'll get it ready quickly. Oh, voice crack. Criminy, please. What the crud? What? Oi, ow! Hey, hey, chill out! What's going on? 
cloud just shrugs. Oh dear. What a disaster. Heidegger was really irritated. The man in the black cape's been roaming the city, but we can't find him. This city? Oh no. The man in the black cape? He showed up two or three days ago and killed a few of our soldiers. He disappeared right after that. There's a rumor going around that it was Sephiroth. Giving, giving the grunts that we've been fighting, like, you know, reminding you of their humanity, it does make, you know, fighting so many people later kind of brutal. Because, like, these are all just people who are just... I don't know. I mean... It's just people joining the military that that's around them, because it's like the thing to do. Even Cloud wanted to join it, originally. Hey, hey, you. You messing with the army? Who cares? You're too lazy. No break for you. Get over here. <laughs> this is the military, soldier. Your orders for today are to send, pres send our President Rufus at the dock. I'll keep drilling you until it's time. I'll help, sir. Me too. Alright, line up in order and show me your final pose. Today's command is formation. Remember it. Ready? The Junon military send-off begin. B, and then you can turn left and right. Oh, that was the wrong button. I need to remember what, where the buttons are. Okay, I've got it. Alright, don't mess up during the real thing. Man, what's today's special pose? Uh-huh. Oh, I haven't decided yet. Alright, rookie, I'll let you decide. Show me your best, your best move. Let's see, my best move is... Wow, awesome. <laughs> Alright, we'll go with that. That's a special. Practice it. I, I could hang out with these guys for hours and I'd be perfectly fine. Well, then me at the dock. Don't be late. Amazing. Just, just amazing. Was that rude? It is rude. about your job step right up okay hold on let me check something now okay now we're just uh now now we actually have free time we can't actually wander around and do whatever we want so it says the first shop this is just materia yeah anything that we don't have Seal magic. Revive magic. Mm. This stuff is painfully expensive, but I'll buy one of each. Uh, one sec. Oh, yeah, I really wish we had gotten that 5,000 gil, that's for sure. Holy crud, I only have 2,000 gil now? It's kind of brutal. That's Shiva now, too. Mm. Alright, sleep and silence, and then life and life two. I think life two heals everybody? Or maybe it heals one person all the way back up to full. That would make sense. <clears throat> Let's see here. No other shops of interest this side of June on. Hold on. So I've got the money to spare, which shouldn't be a problem if you've been selling the ethers. Are you, am I supposed to be selling all my ethers? We suggest you buy one of each. Down the alley is a weapon shop that sells decent weapons, although you probably already have all the weapons if you've been following the stealing notes. Oh, it sells decent weapons, although you probably have all the weapons. Yeah, that's true. Uh, with the exception of Red's Diamond Pen, you can find Rude and the Turks chilling in the bar. 
and other than a casual item store which sells high potions, not an, no no other shops of interest on this side of Junin. Gotcha. Well, hold on. How much is that? Di is that diamond pin good? <coughs> Yeah, we're good on that. Yeah, you know what we can do? I'm <laughs> sure. Just to get our cash up a bit. Could they do that? Nobody woke me up. Nobody woke me up for what? Oh, hold on. I think we're somewhere else. Where is the... Oh, the last door leads to housing. Well, where's the weapon shop, then? I've got money to spare. It's just you do... Oh, down the alley is a weapon shop. This one? Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, it even has, like, a scanner at the door. Interesting. Want weapons? Uh, you probably have nothing. Oh, wow, you actually... Oh, it's the stuff that we've been stealing. Yeah. I mean, diamond pin, but it's worse than what Red has. It, there's no reason to have it, right? Well, okay. Absolute Steve would tell you that, oh, if you want to 100% the game, then oh, then you should have one of every single thing in existence since the, since the dawn of time. Me, personally? I don't think so. I don't think you need to do that. And I don't think I need to do that. Find food and jokes telling it to borrow. Other than a casual item store, none of the shops of interest. Hold on. Rude and everybody chilling at the bar. Down here? Underneath the underneath the shop, which is funny to me. Looks like something's going on outside, but we're too smashed to do anything. Hmm. You too? Take your mask off and come on, that's our rule. Uh nah, I don't think so. Like you're all a little too young to be in here. Not like 20 something. Sorry, it's all rented out today. Yeah, y'all have a good time. That's pretty fun. That's a, that's, a, that's like a fun little thing to run into. Again, little details are really what make what make games like this, you know. Okay, last door leads to housing. Before you head up the stairs, check in the, out the rather concealed soldier standing near the stairs. Oh yeah, I saw him. I actually spotted him when we first here. Hmm. Know it all, huh? Alright, come in. Thank you. What is- are those ghosts? Are those- are those ghosts? Have you taken people's souls? What's- what am I looking at? This is a respectable inn, guess only. You should absorb all the wisdom until it is part of you. Mr. Know-it-all ex-soldier, let me revenge, I mean, review. Oh, it's just... this stuff again. Oh, expert, enlighten us on limit techniques, why don't you? <laughs> oh, and they're still having us explain everything, that's funny. Oh, wait a minute. Oh no, I just realized something. All- those are- those are literally the ghosts of the beginner the beginner hall people because they all died when the plate dropped because that's where they were I think oh no that's that's extremely morbid <laughs> okay well the ghosts of the people stayed behind in case you needed to know anything else about the game in all seriousness this place is anything we... is to ask anything basic wow okay Jeez. Oh yeah, developing limits? Two basic ways of building up your limit techniques. First, just use them. Second, is to finish off as many enemies as possible. Sounds easier than that than it is. Everyone knows that when you gain a new limit technique, you need to select it in the menu. Gotcha. The type and growth of each limit is different. Didn't know about that. That's all about all I will say. Interesting. 
Didn't know that. And another enemy skill materia. Now, I have a question, though. Right? So this one starts back at zero? That's rough. That's super rough, buddy. That's so sad, all the freaking beginner to like, beginner hall people are all dead. <laughs> That's extremely gruesome. All right, well, moving on, I suppose. The stairs is a 35th soldier, which is a, this is a side quest for something. A mine source? Oh, oh, those are cats. I could barely make out what I was looking at. Luxor's. I mean, first off, first off, main character privilege, but also, nobody else is here, so... <laughs> Mine. All for me. L Cloud's gonna live forever, and he's gonna be in the party forever, I promise. Nothing's ever gonna happen to him. Let's see, we go up again, then what's all in here that we need to grab? <clears throat> Oh, for your information, the one, the 135th soldiers are nothing but a collector's item. There's no reward whatsoever for getting 12, 35, 99, or whatever other random amount th of them. They're simply collectibles. Oh, head up the third floor and collect the power source and guard source. Guard source? It's a, yeah, this is like kind of great to run into. Hey, bud. I'm not getting to the parade. The road be to becoming soldier first class is very difficult. Study hard, and maybe I'll kill you someday. Looks like a freaking, like a frat room, jeez. And I'll take some of these pills, and take some of these pills. Mmm, candy. <laughs> huh. Let's start Junin, head down, follow the path of the other major sector of Junin. And if you're quick, you'll see a group of people running to the very end of the area. Did some of them look familiar? I, I, I think I know what this is leading to. <clears throat> um, let's see. Head up the third floor, collect that. Now that you've explored this side of Juno, we can, we can just leave. Okay. <clears throat> Duly noted. Just walk through. I would assume. Uh oh, yeah, up there. Okay, well. <laughs> Speaking of familiar, I mean, one of them was literally just Red Thirteen. <laughs> but all right. Hit up every place. Oh! Hey gang, how we doing? President is safe because we're here. Hi, Lena. Just when I think the job's boring, you guys start messing around. <laughs> well, what do you mean? Can I talk to Sang? Hey, G.I. Joe, aren't you still on duty? No. You don't know. I won't talk to Sang. Sang, look at me. Look at me, Sang. Unless the implication here is that, like, hey, if Sang actually could talk to you and see you, he would, uh, kill you on sight? Could be. Who's to say? You sure it's alright? Nap, <laughs> nap while on duty? Forget it. Uh, am I, am I hurt? Oh, no, I'm good. I'll just rest. Huh, pretty sure it's safe to save now. Gosh, trying to make sure, like, be extra careful. Here's the thing, if I miss something, I'm not gonna stress too much about it. It is what it is, these things happen. Please come in. Welcome. Hi. No charge for a smile. Buy a lot? Cutie. What are, What am I... What if we don't, if we don't do this, we can't complete. What bothers me is that the girls make more than me. <laughs> oh, I understand. Uh, oh, these are just things I have. Alright.
Thank you very much, ladies. Just being sold here afterwards, I opened this shop. But to tell you the truth, I'd rather be at the shop downstairs. Why ever so, sir? Good heavens. And I have no money. I said, now, the Absolute Steve says, you want to buy the headband because it'll be make something a lot easier later? We'll see when that later happens. Okay. Only the accessory shop sells things of interest. Silver glass to protect from darkness. Headband. You can spare money, buy one of each. Yeah. Oh, the third door. Oh, third door outside. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. I did buy one of... Hold on. Just to make sure. I did buy one of each, right? Not like two of one. Yeah, apparently the headband's gonna be useful, but I, I mean, I... Me personally, I think you should always buy at least one of every ex ex accessory in these games. You still on duty? Look, I shouldn't talk, but... <laughs> speed source, heck yeah. Cloud does speed. Remember kids, drugs are super cool. <laughs> oh dear. I shouldn't have managed her. this is so embarrassing. They told me I would be staying at a five-star hotels on these trips. Sorry, bud. There's nothing for the, to collecting the soldiers. They're really just a, a collectible. How goofy. One last weapon store in the area, but for the time being, it doesn't sell any new equipment due to a wrong order of the store owner. Come back here on disc two. Head for the far end, and you'll be at the docking area of the cargo vessels. Oh, we're already at this part. I hmm. We are already at this part. As much time as it takes to do everything. Like, we are pretty freaking close, still. Oh, welcome. We don't have much of anything now. I forgot to order enough the last time, but feel free to look around. A mythical sable, cannonball, yeah. Gotcha. Not that we have any money anyways. Let's see. It is also where the send-off of Rufus begins. The commander gives you the orders and you follow them by correctly pressing buttons. And then we get points for this too. Note, the captain's commands are completely random. You get the following prizes for the results. You get silver glasses, HP plus materia, or force stealer. Oh crud. The force stealer is a sword for Cloud with double the growth and three slots. By the way, you can make Cloud move in mysterious ways to send when the send-off is over. He'll do little things like scratching his back with his gun shrug or touch his hip with his hands and pose. That's funny. For perfect game, aim for the best prize, the Force Stealer. It is up to you which of these two you prefer. HP plus materia nets you early HP bonus, but the Force Stealer is a good sword with double growth. In any case, quickly hop on the boat. I mean, if it's a sword, then I want to get that. I wasn't too worried about losing out on that money. Obviously, if you quote-unquote want to get a quote-unquote perfect game, right? It's like, well, yeah, you would do that, but... This one should be easier to do, though. Now, granted, the other one took me off guard and, and like, only took a second before it was over, so... Ooh! Hit my, hit my mic stand. Okay. Here we go. So the commands are random.
Seems like we got, like, over the amount of points we even need. Can we lose points? Surely we can lose points. Ooh, right on time. That gets you like for free 30 points. That's hilarious. Oh, yeah, no, you can just do whatever you want. <laughs> awesome. Well done. Keep up the good work for Shinra Inc. Here's a special bonus for you a token of the president's kindness. Don't forget it. Heck yeah, baby. Oh, look, Red 13's in the background. I didn't even notice that. Is, is, is Cloud standing like Eris right now? Is that what that is? <laughs> Once the word gets out that Sephiroth's here, Cloud and his friends will show up too. This is so funny to me because everybody, everybody acts so serious. Like, like certain characters like Cloud and Rufus and like, like the Turks. They act so serious, and they they think so highly of themselves. They're so full of themselves. It's gonna be so funny. It's so funny that like everybody is already on this ship. Cloud is literally standing right in front of him, and he's such a freaking he's so freaking stupid he can't even tell. <laughs> I mean, we're just like we're a bunch of like like hooligans, just like running, doing these things right underneath his nose, and he can't even tell. We can't have them get in our way. Leave it to me, sir. I thought I told you to stop that stupid laugh. I don't like that Heidegger just will just like go and start punching <laughs> the other troops in the face. And here's the thing, I know that we've straight up killed p these people before, right? So like, I understand that I don't really have a leg to stand on in this in this case, but like, I don't know. That's just straight up abuse. I was close. Heidegger's been really edgy lately. Because Hojo disappeared, leaving a letter of resignation. Oh. Heidegger's been forced to take over the investigation too. Hey, I thought you were dismissed. Thanks for letting me know, guys. I'll see you on the other side. Actually, hopefully hopefully I, I won't see you ever again. Because I, I like you guys. You, you're cool. You're chill. And I, I will. And if I see you again and you stand in my way, I will cut you in half. <laughs> Got some cleaning up to do. Hurry up. Sorry, gang. Can't do that. Uh, was there anything else to do first before I hop on the ship, actually? We got the Force Stealer. First try. Awesome. Um, to sunny places. On the cargo boat. This section requires a lot of time. What? <laughs> Alright, hold on. We'll, uh... We'll see about this. But we do just... Hop on. Hop on the boat, I think. Any case, quickly hop on the boat before it departs. Yeah. Good to go. We'll cross the ocean to the new continent. Even if we're wearing Shinra's uniforms. Ah, the music. Is peaceful. The freaking music. All right, let's go get our goods. Um, let's see here. Now this says 
There is an, there's, there's another Absolute Steve perfect game note, number 12. <laughs> let's, let's take a look. He says, uh, this section requires a lot of time. It's quite possibly one of the most time-consuming things of the challenge. You must steal 99 Shinra Betas from Marines. And yes, that takes a lot of time. There are some things that speed it up, though. Using L-Force Suicide on the Marines at the start of each battle, and they'll be inflicted with a small status, only dealing one damage for the remainder of the battle. Needless to say, oh, needless to say this saves you a lot of healing time. Look up a headband of your stealing character, the one with the highest level, and the silver glasses on the others. On the other, a headband will protect against sleep, so you can keep stealing with that character. Silver glasses protect against darkness, so you can dispatch the marines of whom you've already stolen from. The Shinra Beta is furthermore a decent piece of equipment, which you may want to equip on your characters. In other words, if you're a psychopath and think that you need to have 99 of every single item in the game, you could do this. Um, I'm going to not do this. <laughs> if you if if you don't mind, but if we only run to the Mariners, I will try to steal some of the uh, armor because that sounds good. This is why I hate ships. Hey Cloud, you have any tranquilizers? Here, use this. Thanks. Oh, gross. This is bitter. Where are the others? I don't know. Aren't they hiding somewhere around here? What should I know? I'm working hard already. Oh, I'm working hard already. You still want me to do more? The president's probably the same. He's just gonna order us around anyways. The first time I, I came here, I like... It, it didn't occur to me that certain characters were like people that we knew at first, which is funny. Hey Yuffie, can I uh, get past there? Uh, maybe- oh, we probably have to wait till we are, we're all reunited before I can get back down here and get that, huh? That's an all materia though, for free, which is great. Okay, she won't move until later on. Let's see. I get to work. Both the new president Rufus and, and Heidegger are aboard the ship. If we do good, we could get promoted. Hey, what's wrong, kid? You've got no prep. A seaman's gotta have oomph. I'm tired. Something's missing. What do you mean, missing? Gotcha. No, we're good. We don't need to sleep either, right? I mean, yeah, everybody should be fully restored, I would imagine. President Rufus and his men are on the bridge of the ship. If they see you slacking, they'll bust you one. The music's so goofy. Yes, sir, everything quiet, sir. But you know what? I really hate this uniform. Uniform, soldiers, war, I hate them all. They take away the things of the people you love. I wish they'd all disappear, right, Cloud? Yeah, I think so. You're right. Uh, yes, sir. I'll continue my watch, sir. <laughs> Giggle. Giggles like a schoolgirl. <laughs> oh, this freaking nonsense. The funniest thing ever. <laughs> Almost at Costa del Sol. When I get there, I'm gonna take a long overdue vacation. I think I'll go down to the beach and get a tan. This utter nonsense up here. It makes no sense for so many reasons, and I need... I need to see it fully realized. <laughs> it's me, Red 13. I'm a little woozy, but I shouldn't get caught. What do you mean you shouldn't get caught? Humans only look at appearances anyways. Anyway you look at it, I'd say I make a fine human being. It's so ridiculous. It doesn't make any sense. How are they going to justify this? I, I like I don't understand. Ah, uh, this game's this game is perfect. So wh where is Eris and then where is uh where's Barrett?
genuinely, it actually feels like a sh it, like we've been away from our friends for a shockingly long time. That's how we get here. Fred, is there anybody else over there? It's pretty hard standing on two feet. Yeah, no kidding, bud. I'll go back down and see if there's anything else to do. Well, that's the staircase going up. But hold on, wait, it's the staircase going up, but... But... Is it completely blocked off by crates and boxes and stuff? That doesn't make any sense, what? What kind of... Well, how... This is... This doesn't seem organized at all. So, what do I do? Head down and speak to Eris. Head down to speak with Eris. Head down from where? Oh, is there another, is there another ladder over there? Well, it looks like there is, but I can't, uh... Upper left, upper left. The fact that this group of absolute, <laughs> th th this this group of people were able to do this is so funny to me. Head down to speak with Aeros, who's lo located on the upper left. A tail that must be red. Head down to speak with Aeros. Just like a soldier? I am extremely confused. Unless, like, she's down here. Is that her? Oh! <laughs> hey, Cloud, do you see Barrett? I hope he's not doing anything stupid. Well, Barrett will be hard to miss because he's built like a tank. Oh, oh, and no, this thing's freed up. Oh, look, it's Barrett. They're doing something maybe a little stupid. <laughs> look, Cloud, it's Rufus and, and Heidegger. They're too close. Oh, wait, they're this close, but we can't do anything to them. And he go off laughing like that because of him, Biggs, Wedge, Jesse. Barrett! God, I can't take it anymore. I gotta settle things here and now. Oh, still a found. Not those not on detail. Search the ship. Report and found. Still away on board. Ooh. Did they find us? I don't think it's us. Did they find Tifa and the others? Get off your spiky button, let's go, Cloud. Alright, let's go. Jeez, alright. <laughs> Don't gotta tell me twice. Um, okay. So, we will be wanting to steal from those guys, the, uh, the Marines. I 
And then we can also get that all material from where UV was. Duly noted. Oh, cool, it's all of us. Everyone all right? You all right? Huh? Everyone's here, right? Hey, wait. You don't think that suspicious stowaway is... Sephiroth? Really? How the hell am I supposed to know? Let's find out. It's the most logical thing to do. Then who's going to go? Not, not me. I don't even like Sephiroth anyways. Besides... <laughs> Come here, Yuffie. <laughs> no. No, Yuffie. It's okay. Well, the people with Materia are Yuffie and Red right now. Will we have access to everybody to be able to remove Materia from them? Or maybe everybody's Materia is just going to be removed anyways. Well, let's see. For a confrontation like this, how about we... Everybody, everybody's leveled up the same. Cloud's actually two levels ahead now because of all the running, independent running back and forth he had to do. Sephiroth, all right, let's go. Okay, what do we... <laughs> what do we have? Uh, sure, I'll give you enemy skill just so you have it. You can have revive, you can have seal, you can have Shiva. Tifa, I'll give you sense. Can we get materia from other people? Well, I'm definitely gonna want to get steel. Clothes are too tight on me. Can I switch with you? Okay, cool. Uh, so we can do it like this. These <laughs> clothes are too tight on me. Um, okay. Red. Oh, no. Do I have... Um, okay, well, first off, I am going to take that. Yeah, I'll take both of those, actually. Tifa said, take me with you. Sorry, Tifa, one sec. I certainly will. Can have that. Can you keep everything else? I think you can keep everything else. Well, what else do you have right now? Heal magic. Hmm. For now, probably. I mean, yeah. For now, probably do that because I mean, I don't know. I mean, having th the shame about enemy skill is that it's like you don't. It, it doesn't just have the abilities you have. You have to go back and get them again. Which I'm wondering if the guide's gonna su suggest doing that. I might consider it, although it would be kind of annoying to do that. Okay. I think we're pretty good now. Oh, Tifa actually has a limit ready. <laughs> that's pretty that's pretty good actually. Um Definitely have steel. I can rock with this team for a little while. Um and you can have it equipped just to have it equipped, I suppose. Uh who had the rest of the materia? Oh, uh Yuffie did, hold on. I love the materia system. I will say having to manage it with like party members dipping in and out is kind of not great. Okay. Cool. 
Cool. Okay, I'm rolling with this. We do it. We going. Oh, okay, people dead. Engine room suspicious character. There's no way. It's not a human. That thing's not human. I like that. Just the mention of like that thing's not human. Well, because the reveal here that happens on the ship is very interesting because it sort of recontextualizes a lot of like the other encounters with quote unquote, um, like, like quote unquote Sephiroth that people seem to be having or say like saying that they're having. Well, we got another all material, which is great. Sure, Tifa. Have poison. <laughs> I'll tank your stats just a little bit more. Oh. Marines? Are these the Marines? Quite Tifa immediately fell asleep. Oh, this is just what they do. This is just what they do. They just put your guys to sleep forever. All right, well, I need to get that thing on Tifa if I'm gonna have her steal stuff. I wonder, could I have, could I aim beta at Tifa? And then, and then would that give her enemy skill? Or does an enemy have to do it? Does an enemy have to use it? That would be kind of, that's like kind of a good question, right? Okay, no sleep on you. Actually, now that I think about it, I need to uh, put this on. It's a little bit better and it does double. So, cool. Ooh, I am going to lose a couple things. No more elemental slash on that. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, well, this doesn't. This doesn't upgrade. Okay, question questions. Okay, so now that... Okay. Now... Ooh, now we have to think about some stuff. Okay, so Chocomog upgrading question probably good? Question mark? Any skill, long range, good. That's probably good. Um, and what we'd probably know what, we, what we want is things that are gonna get more abilities to have the double AP boost, right? Like that makes sense to me. Um, which means probably just remove those two things. And then what? Uh, anything that I would want to do? Well, I could <laughs> try to get Mug, which is just really intense. Um, okay. Getting this Cure Magic up would be pretty big. That's for sure. Does all work on Revive, I wonder? That's, that would be kind of wild. Opponent to sleep. What if I put everybody to sleep? <laughs> Is the question now. Oh, 
I'm gonna make I'm gonna make Tifa's punches fire punches because I think that sounds cool. How about that? <laughs> I could just have some of these things equipped just to. Just to do it. Upgrade, mm, upgrading this faster would be also be cool. Mm. Sure. Stronger poison spell sounds kind of neat. Okay, well, we do want to try to steal some of that stuff. So we, we, we're equipped to do that now. So I'm going to do that for a little bit and I'll get back to you. You're not what I want. You're not even what I want. Holy crap, that took way too long. <laughs> Jeez. Tifa's not even that far behind Cloud. I don't know if it would, how much of a benefit or a boost it would be to give Cloud Steel instead of Tifa, but I might do it just for like the little tiny boost it might give. First things first though, let's actually see. Shinra Beta. No magic defense, no... No, hmm. No defense percentage? Like percentage blocked, but I don't really sure what that means. But no magic defense on this one, really. Only if for only three more defense. Doesn't seem amazing. Feels kinda like Okay. I don't think I'm gonna get any more then. I'll ha I'll have three. So that I did, maybe I'll put it on Barret since Barret's just kind of a tank. Maybe I'll put it on like red as well. I'll uh, because it was normal growth too. I'll check uh. Yeah, I'll check. I'll check the slots on it again compared to like what we're all wearing. We're still we're still wearing the carbon bangles, anyways, which is kind of funny. Let's see. Shinra Beta has uh, has one more slot for Materia. Mm hmm. I could see the potential. The potential is not lost on me. However, like the material that the extra material that we have right now is just like two alls and a cover. It's like yeah, whatever. All right, we're finally going in. Cloud falls asleep immediately, of course. Gosh dang it. Well, Tifa still can't fall asleep. These guys just put you to sleep and then immediately wake you up by shooting you in the head. Gosh dang it. Well, Aerith is in the back row, to be fair. Don't shoot her while she's down, you scumbag. Okay. Is there anything else to do in the meantime? We got the all materia that was being blocked. Well, hold on, we did get the all material that was being blocked, right? 
surely we did. Big level ups. Okay. A bunch of eye drops, too. Yeah, yeah, we got it. All right, what, we go up this ladder first? Walk over, first climb up the ladder and get Wind Slash. What is that? Plus is this? <laughs> Stop doing, Stop freaking gassing us. Quit gassing me up, man. Dang it, that's a shame. Oh, this next boss nullifies gravity and, and poison. Okay, good to know. Wind Slash. Apparently this is for Yuffie? It says, a good weapon for Yuffie with double growth, which we suggest to use. Oh, wow, okay. Jeez. I mean, yeah, we're, we're all finding stuff that does double growth now, which is pretty freaking good. Oh, and it's a back attack? For Pete's sake, I just want to get down and get the <laughs> get to the boss fight, man. Come on. Have mercy on me. I'm using beta. Get me out of here. These guys do just enough damage, it's kind of concerning. Nice. Alright, there we go. Now we're going to drop some heal magic on everybody real quick. And uh, let's just walk right in. Is it Sephiroth? Oh. No, not Sephiroth. After a long sleep, the time... Time has come. Sephiroth, you alive? Who are you? You don't remember me? I'm Cloud. Cloud. Sephiroth, what are you thinking? What are you doing? Watching Sephiroth slowly rise through the ground with no explanation as to how he could possibly be doing that now? I, uh, I love it. I hate it, but I love it. <laughs> and then he just drops. Oh, Genova's theme is so good. Oh, why don't we use some summons? I have some summons I could possibly use. Genova's theme will never not be good. It's just always good, forever. All of eternity. Um... I'll have... yeah. Cloud, you do your thing. good damage. Not a thousand damage like anybody else, but it is a boss. Just like the sheer panic that this moment evokes, watching Sephiroth rise to the ground and then fly up into the camera and drop something, and then you're just fighting this thing. She's awful. She, she's just awful, too. And like, she's so otherworldly, the music is so otherworldly too, because I'll have to use the synths and stuff, right? Oh, 
I think it's going to be fine though. I didn't even I didn't even take a moment to appreciate the summon animation, which is very good. I mean, I'll, I'll, some Final Fantasy summons are always great. Ooh. Oh, Tifa gets a limit break again. Jeez. Choco buckle. Now I'll save it. She's getting a lot of pot shots in. Oh, here we go. Full heal. Eris is so good. Eris is so good, and you feel it. When when things happen later on, you you feel the difference. <laughs> Okay, Tifa. Ah, uh, giving giving a boss just the, its own theme just sets sets the mood so perfectly. White cape. I've seen this before. Genova, the arm of Genova. Genova, he's been carrying this thing around. That was just Genova's arm. So it was Sephiroth. The time is now. I think that's what was said. The time is now. I'm getting so confused. Cloud, explain what's happened so far. I'll try. I'll try, but don't interrupt me while I'm explaining. Hey, Cloud, pick that up too, by the way. <laughs> if, you, if you could for me, please. Sephiroth went off searching for the Promised Land, so he could become the ruler of the planet. That was five years ago. Then Sephiroth came back and killed President Shinra. Then just now, all of us saw Sephiroth. He was carrying Genova with him. This much I do know. He told me he wants to go to the Promised Land with his mother, Genova. I guess that's about it. We should hide somewhere again. Uh, Ifrit Materia, thank you, bye. Sephiroth is alive. Promised Land, does it really exist? Oh, moody. Moody, eerie, frightening even. I'm scared, ah! And now something completely different. No cosmic horrors here. <laughs> Dang, sure is hot here. But I sure feel better now that I can say goodbye to the sailor suit. Like see you be running on top of the ship. Yo, listen up, y'all better y'all be sure to mingle like regular folks here. Oh, too bad. I liked Parrot's sailor suit. <laughs> he looks so cute. What do you mean cute? I love I love Yuffie just running back and forth in the background. Right, well, uh, Barrett, why don't you use that sailor suit for pajamas? Right, Cloud? Now nah, let's loosen up, I guess. Ah, you look like a bear wearing a marshmallow. The hell is that supposed to mean? This, this happens to be the most comfortable, so shut up. Would you kindly hurry? The heat is drying my nose. Yeah, mine too. Alright, we'll take a break, then head off. Don't wander too far off. Cloud says to his children, I wonder wherever I... <laughs> wherever I sure well want. Who made him leader? <laughs> like my name got messed up. I'm gonna rest somewhere cool. Don't bother looking for me. 
So apparently everybody is doing something different at at this place, depending on uh, who's in your party, who's not. Can we switch parties whenever? Doesn't seem like it. You're stowaways, right? It's okay, I'm used to them. Truth is, before I worked here, I was one of the best. Don't bug me, this is the first official Miss Alp. Screw you, man. So jealous. I'm just so jealous of him I could spit. We're both about the same age, but he's president. Bunch of hardworking deckhands like you wouldn't understand. On the marine blue sea, gazing at the eternal skies that seem to go on forever, gives you the feeling like you're taking a nap on the wing of a Cessna. It's the ultimate high. That's great. Hey, the Shinra Brass are arriving soon. Got nothing to do with us, does it? Got a little bit to do with me. Oh, wow. Dang, we got, we got plot heavy all of a sudden. Am I, am I gonna watch this helicopter land the entire, the entire way over there? <laughs> oh, okay, no, there's, there's, there's Heid, Heidegger. Oh, and there's Rufus. Oh, I thought they, I thought they were in the heli the helicopter. It's about a long boat ride. Good work, everyone. You know, here's the thing about Rufus. He does congrat, he does, you know, uh, praise his underlings often. Which is, you know, he doesn't have to do that. Hurry up with that. Yes, sir. Hey, yeah, Sephiroth was on board. Yes. Seems Cloud and the others were on board, too. Yes. They all slipped through. You messed up big. You messed up big this time. I'm ashamed of myself. Is that all you can do? Give one word answers and apologize for everything? Who Rufus is not his dad. <laughs> do something. I'll be expecting results. Don't punch that guy. Hey! Hey! Don't punch these guys! These guys didn't do anything! Wait, why is, he, why is he running down that guy? That's not even one of your workers! Oh my gosh, he's so... It's so funny. Him running down some random pedestrian for no good reason. Um, yeah, okay. I mean, oh, yeah, Red's kind of like sort of playing with. Well, this is lovely. This is fun. Is there a save point somewhere? Or would I have to wait till I get out? Yeah, we're at a whole new place now. Who would have thought? Look at us. Oh, Cloud. Look, look at that. The funniest thing. Finding out that Hojo, like, resigned, and now he's just... <laughs> he dressed the same. Here, hanging out with... But, but I've seen Ho I've seen what Hojo looks like in the remake. He is not an attractive guy. He must have like unbelievable riz to be able to like pull ladies the way that he seems to notoriously do. Not just in this scene. There's other things later on that you learn where it's like, how possibly did he pull like that? I just, I just don't know. That girl in the bikini? Who Hojo? Is that man over there, Hojo? Go over and talk to him. It's so funny to randomly like run into people like this. God, what do you want? Is that Hojo? What's his problem? Yeah, that's right, it's a professor. Professor, somebody needs to see you, sir. 
I'm busy right now. But, not too bad. No, I remember you all now. Yes, yes, I remember now. It's been a long time, Cloud. Not too long. Hojo. Sometimes you just gotta do something like this. What are you doing? Should be obvious I'm getting a tan. Honestly, the one dude who probably really needed to go out and touch grass, he, he did it in the best way possible, so good for him. Living his best life. Hmm, I believe we're both after the same goal. I mean, Sephiroth. Did you see him? I see. What is it? Nothing. I just remembered a certain hypothesis. Haven't you ever had the feeling something is calling to you? Or that you had a... You had to visit someplace? I'll go anywhere Sephiroth is at. To beat him and put an end to all this. I see. This could be interesting. Were you in Soldier? Would you like to be my guinea pig? Oh, now what? You gonna draw your sword? Cloud, don't. If he dies, we won't find out anything. Say, aren't you the ancient... I'm Ares, at least you could do is remember my name. I want, you, I want you to tell me something, Professor Hojo. I know I'm an ancient, my mother told me. Your mother? Oh, you mean Athalna. How is she? You didn't know she died. I see. Professor Hojo? Is Genova an ancient? Is Sephiroth an ancient? Do we all have the same blood? Head west. He's mumbling slowly. It must mean he's hiding something. Hey, answer us. Tifa. No, that's okay, Tifa. Go beat up this guy. It's fine. Nobody here should mind. Why? Well, I don't know. I mean, these, these, these ladies might mind, because they seem to be super into him, which... You know, the heart wants what it wants, I suppose. It's no use. It's no go. Yep, takes off his lab coat, even the heat. I guess that's the mark of an intellectual. Oh, gosh. I'll interpret Professor Hope's chosen whispers. Head west, past Mount Coral, and keep going. Did you get that? I didn't understand it well myself. I'd be happy to be a guinea pig if it's for, <laughs> if it's for Professor Hojo. They called him the Rizzler. He just can't be stopped. Ladies, watch out. Ladies, maybe guys even, maybe. Dogs, Red 13, run. Professor Hojo's coming to Riz you. <laughs> it's, too, it's too late. It's too late in the day for me to be talking like this. Oh. Hey, Yuffie. Yuffie, why are you in, why are you in the truck? Orders are taken at the counter. Why are you running a food stand? Ah, oh, Cloud, let me make a buck, why don't you? I'm selling materia, why don't you buy some? You're selling materia? Yuffie, this doesn't make any sense. Also, where have you gotten this materia? Is this not just all the materia we own? Hey, bud. That's interesting. It's not as if I'm doing this because I want to. You see, this tale of mine moves quite independently of my will. <laughs> nah, come on, Red. You're loosening up. Butch. Well, why is this guy named? I'm lucky to have that cutie working for us part time. My my dude, my man, that is a 16-year-old girl. So chill out, okay? Barrett? Hmm? Barrett's in the <laughs> suit. <laughs> yeah, someone's in here, all right? <laughs> Barrett. Barrett, please have mercy on me. He put the... He, he's, he's in the mirror, like looking at this because everybody said that he looked good in the sailor suit oh my gosh 200 kill a night do i even you sure i'll just be playing around here drop by whenever you feel like how much money do i even know i do have money now okay sure i'll stay one night you must be tired weather from coast to del sol tomorrow is gonna be sunny again cradled by the sound of the ocean sweet dreams
That's nice to actually add the ocean waves. That's a nice touch. This game's a vibe sometimes. Good morning. Be careful traveling. Oh, is everybody in here now? Because Bear's not there anymore. Ah, crud, did that reset everything? Well, we did see everybody at least. Obviously, depending on who you have in your party, people change or whatever, right? Apparently, Eris and... According to the guide, Eris and Tifa would be... Um, getting a tan? Probably out at the beach? So boarding is what's happening this year. Ooh, oh no. Visions of the future. <laughs> Dark things to come. Snowboarding. Snowboarding is an ill omen. Well, I'm heading over to Gold Saucer now. I'm gonna make a ton of money at the Chocobo races. Then we're gonna take a trip to the Icicle Inn and snowboard. Oh crud. Uh, is Cosmo Canyon before that though? The Gold Saucer? Well, there's probably things to do here, but first I want to save. So save I do. Hey, actually, once again, we're gonna end it here because that was like over two hours. And not every single episode needs to be like three to four hours long. And that was a decent amount of stuff, honestly. That was a lot of story. We ended a Sephiroth in person for the first time. Uh, in not a flashback. We ended Rufus again in person for the second time, though he didn't know it. Uh, so yeah, I think we're just gonna call this there because now we're gonna be getting into a whole other, uh, like, brand new area. We're on a brand new continent, basically. The whole bunch of other areas and a bunch of other things to find and look for and presumably more um, secrets and hidden things to go scour for as well. So hey, if you enjoyed this, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell to get notified of more things in the future. Episodes of this just about every single day. Links in the description of things that I am doing, have done, or will be doing in the future. Check out the rest of the channel. Uh, chances are there's probably something that you would be interested in or enjoy on it somewhere if you looked if you looked deep enough. I post just about everything on this channel. Um, also, me and my friend are making a game. Any and all support towards that would be much appreciated. You can check out the links down below for stuff on that. We've also made a game actually for a game jam for the Big Mode Game Jam. If you want to check that out? The link will be in the in the description for that as well. Check it out. Let us know what you think of it about it. It's, it's, a, it's a shoot 'em up. And also, if you know anybody else who likes shoot 'em ups, throw it their way. If you know people who don't like shoot 'em ups, throw it their way. Check it out. Get some eyes on that. Um, and then that's about. That's about it. Oh, also, me and my friend are currently still making an actual full fledged game. Uh, not a short game. An actual, like, full sized game. It's gonna be just as long as this game. No, it's not. It's really, it's really, really not. Um,. But yeah, if that sounds interesting at all to you or you'd like to help us on that endeavor, then you can help us by supporting the videos, supporting the streams, and uh, most of all, support the Patreon. And with that, don't forget to be kind, and I will see you next time.